yes. Good day and welcome to a GTA playlist with your favourite people at Hat Films. Woo, that's us. Yay. Hi. Are we your favourite still? Leave a comment below. Oh, God. A thorough Cutting detailed the, explanation. The hard questions. Been very introspective after talking about Bo Burnham in our last episode, which you should totally check out. You son of a. Bah! Right, I got him. Oh, he got me! <laughs> he got me too! Yeah, we're very intros introspective there. Um, looking at our own careers and comparing them to someone way more successful, and that's <laughs> healthy. <laughs> who's who's healthy. literally got a Netflix special. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> There's another I saw loads of people doing that, though. I saw loads of people doing that in terms of just like, oh, I saw myself in that. It's just like, I don't want to be that guy. But here we are. We're doing that. We're, we're being those guys. And that's fine. <laughs> Did you, did you also see there's Whatever. a Netflix show that a trio of comedians that have a YouTube channel also got? You mean the... Go Auntie on, Donna. go on. Auntie Donna. Little yeah, light yeah. on the ground in detail, but go on. Auntie, Auntie Donna. Donna. Oh, yeah. Auntie Donna. Auntie Donna. Yeah, they, that was good. I'd like to think that that's launched them to even higher highs. I'm sure it's I hope so. put them into a whole different demographic, yeah. I mean, they've been really good for ages, and I think, I, like, mm. it's just nice to see. Yeah, hopefully, some more, more stuff. They're I mean, very, very they must have not. And funny. Probably takes a lot of writing, I imagine. But yeah. Oh yeah. The actual show itself looked like they could knock it out in a week. They do a ton of like live performance and theatrics as well, so they're very comfortable just doing it, all of that stuff. Yeah. Just respect, respect, Res respect on that. Respect somehow, on that. Somehow Cowdoy came out of that as the most memorable Cowdoy. joke for me. Cowdoy. I think that Cowdoy's, has for a lot of people. Cowdoy's a good housemate. He always plays his rent or something. Everything's a drum. <laughs> Everything's a drum. And then obviously um, the appearance of... Uh, what was his name? Egg. Egg Helms. Egg. <laughs> Egg No, no, Helms. guys. My name's Egg. Just... Serious? It's just like it's one of those jokes which is just like it isn't immediately funny because it's just like what they're just going with the joke egg and like well I guess yeah fine that works it, it was just yeah it, it didn't seem funny at the time but when I rewatched it I was like oh, yeah it's pretty funny egg it's just so simple and then he changed it on his social media to egg as well meta <laughs> very meta I'm sure he's a producer or something right but yeah our Netflix series that how's that gonna go. Well, we need to get well, we games on that If it one? went as well as our Spotify pitch, then um, who knows? Yeah? What's our I Spotify think, what did we pitch? pitch to them? I think we pitched to them a D&D &D show, and they said everyone's pitched a D&D &D show. Can you do something else? And we're like, no. no. Yeah. Uh, no, yeah. we can't. That's it. We're like, what do you mean D&D space is saturated? I don't uh, understand. Filled. But have you seen <laughs> films There's to so D &D much though. content to watch. You don't ah. understand Spotify. <laughs> Come on, Spotify, please. No, I don't use Spotify for things like that. Do you guys? I, I just use Not it for music. Podcasts, I don't really use it for really. anything else. Um, I do I listen to some podcasts on there. No. I don't really feel like I take the time out of my very busy in the house lockdown day to listen sure, to podcasts. Yeah. It's usually for like commuting and stuff or walking to somewhere. I, li yeah, I, I literally listen to them whilst walking the dog. Well, there you go. Quite, quite a good one. There I you imagine Mochi just takes a couple steps and she's done and she's tiny. Yeah. <laughs> Quick poop. A, a couple I'm, I, steps. A couple steps and she's done. <laughs> she's so small though. Well, Shit. up and down the stairs three times, that'll do her. Yeah. Easy. Well, I don't know. Is, is that the case? No. Well, how it's tired does she get? Like, how, how quickly does she get tired? She has massive bursts of energy where she tires herself out. Oh, no. I can take her out in the garden. She'll run full sprint in circles for like 15 minutes and then she will not want to do anything else after that and that's enough oh <laughs> she'll tire herself out just doing that she's quite happy to do that <laughs> well fair enough um, but yeah I take her on walks anyway because uh, it's good good training and all that let's uh, find some new shit to eat if possible <laughs> nah, only if people own, that actually like leave their own brand also, most people collect them your own brand that's all you want to keep you know, I ended up having a conversation with um, my family uh, about that. Like, Sorry, just after brain? we talked about it. Wait, no, about dogs and their, and their eating oh, habits. Their yeah. insatiable right. desire. Like, they literally, that literally came up and I was like, you know what? I know about this. We were talking about this the other day. Like, right. it is, you know, it's a hot topic. That's all I'm saying. But what were they talking? What, what were they going at? What, oh, why they were we talking that? about... Oh, I can tell you why. Really want to know. Oh, I mean, it's not, do now. 
Because one oh. of them was saying about how Did you tell they, not saw, to eat? they stopped at some traffic lights, right, before crossing the road, and to their right, there was a guy <laughs> with a golden retriever waiting at the lights, and the golden retriever goes to snap at a big, fresh pile of dog food that's up against the lamppost, and the guy pulls him back the first time, and then the, yeah. they're still waiting for the lights, and then the dog he goes for it again it. and manages to get a whole bite in, <laughs> out, out of this huge, fresh pile, oh. and the dog, the owner, literally grabs the dog, opens its mouth, and scoops it out with his oh. bare hands. Oh, no. Oh, Why would you do that? That's it's gone worst. at that. And point. the person who was telling me the story was just like having to awkwardly wait next to them at these traffic <laughs> lights. His hand covered in shit. guy's hands are now oh. covered in somebody else's <laughs> dog. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, that's oh, that was funnier when I said it back. Holy sh oh, that's so messed yeah. up. But yeah, the <laughs> so there was oh, just this. God. This guy with what can you do? Face. What can he do? He has to make sure his dog's not going to get poisoned by some stranger's dog. Yeah. Kit. And so you, scooping it out is the only option. I mean, I've had to do that before with like these... uh, chocolate, where he's grabbed a bit yeah. of chocolate. I was like, oh, no, no, no. But <laughs> poo. Oh, oh, God. Poo. That's gone. Yeah, that's gone. Oh, just You've lost. Scratch You've lost that one that off battle. as a mistake <laughs> and see how his uh, immune system holds up. Damn it. So that's somebody, that guy loves their dog, you know? That's what you got to be prepared yeah. to do if you're going to have a dog. It's not. I don't think it's. You, you say that it's not just a love thing. It's uh, do I want to spend a shitloads of money at the vet thing? Because if something goes <laughs> right, wrong here, yeah. you know that this exactly. is going to be an expensive What's trip. In do you have insurance crap. for your dog? I do. Yes. Yeah. 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 You should always. But even have. then, there are premiums and stuff. So if you, if he's about to eat some, shit, I'll make sure he doesn't. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just in case. <laughs> oh, Stop. Yeah, Wait. Jesus don't Christ! Do scooping that. it out of his mouth. No, please, it's no. going to be expensive, please. <laughs> Someone's eating quavers. Why would that put you off quavers, though? Quavers aren't anything like poo. If you were eating a chocolate mousse, I'd be like, yeah, put it down. Quavers, though, nothing like it. Depends on your shits, I guess. <laughs> they curl yeah, out and they're God, very thin and crispy. They curl so out the majority and get crispy in the sun. It's just power. It's uh, actually onion isn't it really onion and cheese a quaver it's not just cheese by any means probably uh, oh, yeah, no, onion yeah. powder it's just a powdery onion powder onion. and cheese powder I think yeah I don't know yeah quavers I don't I'm mind not, I quavers I don't dislike a quaver I, I'd, I'd rather quavers over skips oh, oh, skips yeah, is at the bottom probably. I love skips yeah but then where would you put where would you put I love um, skips yeah why oh Skips are great. What's your love for skips? Why is it because they melt it's in your that mouth? Sweet or is it prawn cocktail, it's like a prawn cocktail taste, isn't and then it? the the melt in your mouth. Oh yeah, it's all great. What's am um, I the only one who gets crazy burps from like um, smoky bacon and like beef <laughs> yeah. crisps? I get yeah, like I beefy do. burps. Oh for, like, god, I just got absolutely like, oh. ass blasted by chocolate. Oh my god. <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah, yeah. The the high oh, man. Yeah, yeah, the bacon crisp stuff. Just, just the very like almost acidy, isn't it? Really? Yeah. Uh, There's something about it where it's just like I have to think like, do I want frazzles. to be tasting this for the next three frazzles. hours? Mm. Frazzle, frazzle, frazzle. Like the frazzle. They're really frazzle. good. What about um? What are the other ones? Lemon scampi crisps. I'll what? See. I don't think I've had those. That sounds you know, fancy. That sounds fancy. That sounds some Waitrose. You know, what's going it's on? It's not, guys. It's not. No, it's like every pub in the country. Scampi fries. <laughs> right, okay. Sure. Scampi fries. Oh. Have you not had a scamp scampi fries? They're I've they're in the same range scampi. of pub I've had crisps pork scratchings, as, but I've not had the, the, the scampi so, fries. Wait, so no. you ever had the bacon? You ever had the bacon? I think frazzles I have had the, at the pub. No, I have had the bacon frazzles. Yeah. No, I didn't. Yeah, really so really same yeah. brand, but yeah, they do yeah, yeah. Uh, scampi fries. They're like, yeah. they're trot. If you like scampi, uh, if you like um, uh, skips, try the scampi fries oh, okay. at the pub because they're gonna blow your mind because they're like a super flavorful so salty. skip. Super yeah. flavor. Mm, I'm not day. as keen on Monster Munch as everyone else is. I feel I like, like the they're flame hot I ones. They're an I annoyance to eat. I wouldn't have more the time, but they're too bulky and, and then they get up in your teeth too much. Well, the pickled onion ones feel pointless. I don't feel like there's hardly any flavor in mm. in, in those. Um, flame and hot are the only only options for me. What's the other What's the other flavor? They do beef and onion or something now. Yeah, I don't beef know. and onion beef. I'll eat, I'll eat any Monster Munch, to be honest with you. Pretty good. Pretty good. I mean, I don't think they're a high-quality snack, but they're, they're, a, they're no. a taste sensation. That's for sure. Right. My mouth's big okay, enough so to get a whole foot in, so... Out of um, 10, what would you give us? Give skips, then, out of 10? Oh, if you were four. doing a tier list. 
Seven. Four. I give a four. four out of ten. A four. Um, yeah, yeah it's I like give it a four as well. It's like insulation that somebody left some fish on, isn't it? In like a way, yeah. Peanuts. How dare you? Not my go-to. How dare you? Oh, Trout's upset about that. I dare. What do you give him a seven, I dare Trout? with ease. I give him a seven. A seven. That's quite high. What about just the classic crisp? The Walkers or Lay's, if you're American, if somebody's like, like branding that What are we talking two. about? Off. Ready? What flavour? Well, um... That's a very good point. Um, cheese let's and onion, just say eight. cheese and onion. Cheese and onion. I, yeah, I'd agree. Cheese and onion are up seven. there. Seven. Seven. What's the weirdest crisp flavour you ever had? Have we had any weird flavours from like other countries? That's why we've done like a taste so. test of this before. Oh. Yeah, we've done some weird ones. I've had uh, hundreds. Of different we've had like tomato it. ones and things like that, um, which aren't that weird, I guess. That's really not hugely weird. Well, I mean, no, I, don't that, be, I mean that question's too broad, Ross. It's too broad, it's too broad. But give the us more. Thing you know, you've ever had rate my mouth. crisp. Lays weirdest thing I've ever had in my mouth. Slug. Don't say slug. Don't Walkers say slug. in the UK. I just said slug. Yes. Huh? Lays is walkers in the UK because um, we get out and about, whereas you guys are lazy. <laughs> you know, Whoa, <laughs> you know what I mean? Walkers, uh, walkers and you just lay. <laughs> <laughs> Very different names, though, aren't they? And that because we've never been lays. Uh, we did make our own sweat crisps. <laughs> we don't yeah, get lays. So we did make our own sweat crisps. To be fair, that's the weirdest flavour of crisps I think we've ever had. And that's... Nah, that's, that's just that regular ready salted. It did, not many uh, people can say that. just it's regular ready salted. It's a bit socky, wasn't it? It tastes like... It's got the socky. odour of sock. Oh. Yeah, it did actually, oh. yeah. It, it tasted like... It was, like I think it, it was the knowing like where eating, it came from more than anything. No, that was it pungent. felt like what gym changing rooms smell like. Yeah. Yeah. That, that was a, the aroma. I still find it hilarious that the people we asked to do it were so just like shocked. It was, was it Hazel <laughs> and Paul? We should have. We probably should have told them. Or maybe they had an yeah. idea. We explained they, briefly. Yeah. After but we told. I mean, yeah. Is that a crime? Is, did we commit a crime by doing that? Is that a criminal act? No, maybe we did actually. I think we did tell them. But they were already we peer pressured. Then what it was. It's like you're on camera that was now. It. You don't. You don't well, want to buckle. Was it, the peer pressure. Yeah. You turn the camera on, you bastard. It's your fault. <laughs> I wouldn't have tasted your weird, grimy. Obviously, mine were tasty, but yours were horrible. Mine were the best because I had Domino's the night before. <laughs> That's <laughs> a trick. We seasoned, we seasoned Such the piggy good well. flavor. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Have we been feeding the piggy pepperoni pizza for six days? Yes, we have. I don't yeah, think delicious. we appreciate how gross that was, though, in general. Just like this, well, the bags, the wringing gross. our own sweat into bags. I mean, the yeah, process, but we perspire yeah. in the same room every day. We've definitely I, I, I breathed in your sweat. Rubbing it off into matter. bags and drink. And, mm. oh. So much fecal matter. I farted directly into Trot's mouth before. And I'd do it again. What? <laughs> Wait, when was that? I feel like you have said that before, but I don't I'm know the so context. Yeah, we, we've Not said it many times. But many, many, many times. Was that many when you were times. camping or something? Or did you... No, just around a mate's house. We are just around a mate's oh, house. Okay. Just, <laughs> because country bumpkins do just messing about. And fart then, against men. Yeah. Boom. Oh. The great fart. I just, I mean, all I remember is one of your friends throwing road signs at us. And that was... <laughs> that, that was all of us. Great time. What a great oh, wait, we were the road signs were down, down the stairs. Signs. Yeah. No, no, yeah. the song oh, was for a stop no, sign that down. Was oh, that was when he was screaming, yeah. I'm in America. <laughs> no, I'm in America! Was, it was oh, after sorry, the, the, the scene from South Park had come out where Randy's saying, oh, I'm sorry, I thought this was America, where he's doing yeah, something that was belligerent. It, yeah. And uh, the guy was shouting that while <laughs> actually doing something belligerent. Which Why I felt are like we so basic, quite, though? I feel like the well, most I mean, stories we weren't, doing, we weren't yeah, the ones throwing the road sign down the stairs. No, but we, no, were, we were there. We experienced it. No, That's but all. like yeah. the stories remember we've the told. Pile of, remember the pile of furniture mm. that was on top of him afterwards yeah. as well? Yeah, yeah he There was like <laughs> three oh, yeah. chairs and like... He was a mess, our friend. He was yeah. drunk. He was just he was absolutely. A, it was a loose just friend. How up we got at that time. It was like a friend of friend that was always in yeah, the group. Yeah, so you try and distance it where you can because I mean, <laughs> the guy was the guy was off his nut. He was going insane. It was at that they moment real when road that signs. stop sign came crashing down. I thought, I'm not going to yeah. be their friend well, anymore. Yeah, a cone as well. This has got real. The cone. He had a cone on his head, didn't he? The traffic. <laughs> oh, <laughs> the, oh, into the. Oh, <laughs> got you. Tragic. God Terrible. Man. So you let a loser. Mazepin. God damn you, Mazepin. Oh, wait, I can't shoot you. Oh, what about Gasly, though? Gasly, yeah. Gazers. 
Gaz has got I knew he had it in him. Got podium. Recently. Of course, that was the uh, Azerbaijan one. Paul Max. Those tyres really, uh, really, really screwed him over. <laughs> Bollock. Like the street. The street courses oh, just no. seem to cause so much more trouble. Nice. But that was a good race. If you're into your into F1, the Azerbaijan race was uh, it was interesting. A lot of stuff happened. Not necessarily all good stuff. But it happened. But it happened. More interesting than Monica, that's for sure. Ooh. Well, I was always... Yeah, more interested in... Um, in well, the ones one? where they can actually pass each other. Yeah, 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 definitely. Actual overtakes rather than just obviously it's so tight that, yeah, that's just impossible. Oh, God, what you're a big F1 head. Would you Massive. <laughs> head. That's what they call them. F1, F1 head. head. F1 head. F1 head. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I couldn't believe Vettel did that. And then you had that uh, overtake at that one point. Yeah. And then. Yeah. That's actually spot insane. on. insane. You're like, you, you, you're joking. Right at the end as you know, well. You, you've just said Vettel's name because you know Vettel's name. But Vettel actually did get yeah. podium. So you did well. Thank you. And he's not been doing well. Do you know it's, what team yeah, he is with now? Upset. Yeah, the Lamborghini and... Um, Lamborghini. <laughs> oh, Lamborghini. <laughs> Lamborghini okay. don't have an F1 team. Oh, he stumbled. They it. should, though, shouldn't they? Volvo are doing great out there. And Volvo. Uh, obviously, Vox and, and Vox Skoda. Are impressive. <laughs> yeah. Skoda. Nah, I mean, I'd like to see that, though. I'd like to see what they could make. I think they're in a different metal, league, uh, aren't they? Yeah. Red Bull? They're probably, I think they're in different uh, motorsports. Vettel uh, is in um, Aston Martin now. Yeah. Alongside You know what they Stroll. say, drop? Vettel mm. protects. Nice. Do they? Yeah. Who's Vettel, saying that? The, the adverts. How does that relate to him, though? And that, like, what's the correlation? Yeah, yeah. Bring it just, back to him. Just the name alone and the, the rhyming. Pretty much. Right. He, he protects his podium. He can't get point. clean. I don't know. He's <laughs> on, <laughs> having he horrible faults with his cars. Uh, no, tires, more specifically. I did hear about that, where it was just literally off the podium. He. Um, his car stopped working. That sucks. Oh, Jesus. That was Leclerc, I believe, on the previous race. Ooh. He probably won't be able to get his second house. Which sucks. Uh, <laughs> you don't think so? No. I think, uh, I think he probably still can. I want to see It's a, it's people a sport like, of billionaires. I want to see a big upset where you have uh, YouTube streamers and like car sim enthusiasts yeah. that turn into races that then win I think we're starting right. to see some of it right there was like one entrant that was that yeah well there's um, Jimmy Red Broadbent's Bull. doing some actual racing yeah, stuff right? is that what Jimmy you mean like, kind of yeah Jimmy Broadbent did an actual race where the digital world meets the yeah. real world I'd love to see scenarios. again where yeah. the real world yeah. met the digital world and came back to the real world yeah. again it's also a testament to um, you know the simulations and how good they are they yeah, get better, nowadays. They? Um, d did you hear that? Uh, uh, we talk about them too often, but the uh, Paul Brothers. Mm. I'll say it like that. They were saying that they were in a simulation as well recently, and that the whole fact that they managed to arrange that fight with Mayweather and feels Logan like a simulation is very bizarre. But obviously, a hugging match. We all know, like you look past it you really you realize that it is literally just it's all a cash grab so that's that's what it is of course yeah you've the fact that it, it happened and everyone, what it is. even if you hated it you wanted to know what happened exactly out of spite exactly so <laughs> they do have that locked down they have people's interest but mostly, mostly because they've made people hate them and now people want to see their, them get their asses kicked by professionals <laughs> um, regardless yeah. of if they're in their 40s that's pretty much it <laughs> yeah they, they've They've milked so, the the hate for them yeah, as it, well as the love. It works both ways. Yeah, it yeah. works both ways. Because if, if you want to see them succeed, you can watch the fight and cheer them on or whatever. But if you want to see them fail, you'll you might watch the fight maybe illegally. You might not watch it properly, or maybe watch the highlights later, or just you know sleep through it because it is boring. Mm -hmm. um, and then yeah, see if he's got his ass kicked. But all it just proved was just how ridiculous the whole facade is now. Mm -hmm. I mean, there are a lot of people who are also oh, fans of them. Oh my god! Well, of course, like, oh, god, yeah, of course, kind of crazy yeah, the to responses to some even. of the tweets. Like, a um, few people I follow are like, "Who do you think is going to win?" And yeah. people's responses to that is like, "Logan Paul for sure. He's he's going to win. He's my favorite," and stuff yeah. like that. That was his second ever fight, and it was with 
Floyd Mayweather. That's the impressive That's part pretty crazy, in, terms, in that it? whole thing. Because it's just like, but also highlights how stupid it is. That's the thing. It's just like, mm. oh, okay, well, this is dumb. Money and fame Obviously, gets no you where you want to go. Um, and the sanctity of the sport be damned. <laughs> Well, yeah, no. In this, I mean, they're printing money. Yeah, this it's is just. All about I mean, money. I, I believe there was a quote from Mayweather saying it was legalized bank robbery from his part. <laughs> yeah, you know, uh, uh, you know. Is Africa, he you trying know, to massive... redeem his character nowadays? I feel like that's the thing. I don't know. I feel no like he's idea. trying to be like, you know, he's the real guy now. He's the real Logan. Uh, he's the real Paul. Uh, he's not. A what, he's, Paul? He, he acknowledges oh, God, that no. he's a douchebag or whatever. And that he's done wrong I things. Know. I think they. I think they need. They're, they're leaning into the douchebag thing as hard as possible because they're making more money by doing it. Mm. And you know that's the business. They strategy. should make them fight each other. Well, that's it. Exactly. I think that's the. <laughs> that'll be the ultimate one. Rather than I these feel like other, Jake Paul has fallen off a fights. little bit. I feel like Logan's more popular. Fallen off of what? Like the the brother popularity scale. <laughs> Right. One seems well, much you, more popular than the other now. In your own head, you realise this is yeah. living rent free in your own head. Drop. Yeah. It's just like, God, yeah. Which one's winning? The fact you're even sub, the fact you're even subconsciously tracking that just proves something, doesn't it? Quite well, it's uh, made me think about it now when I'm thinking about yeah. I, yeah. Logan Paul's Stop much more in the news. Stop making me think about a lion. Don't think about a lion. I'm just seeing I'm myself in the MGM not. logo. You know, get that lion out of your head. Get <laughs> I'm him out of your head now. And a tiger now. I'm, I'm actively going away from the, the lion. Stop it. And all the lion's I, back. The lion's I'm thinking back. of a lion bar. Does that count? Again. The, I'm thinking the lion's of a lion railing an elephant. It's a chocolate What's that bar. Lion That's doing the same there, thing. A, it's not a lion no. bar. It's a lion peanut. It's a peanut with a lion's face on it. Oh, no, God. No, no there it is. I'm thinking of Lion King. Ah! In all of these well, shots, uh, Logan Paul is there. All of them. All of them just in the background. <laughs> like a waving. watermark on every just image you waving. imagine. Just burnt in. Like a TV burn in. Uh, I don't... Uh, um, I don't like what they're doing, but uh, it's working. So that's all I got to yeah. say on that. Uh, yeah, I was never a massive boxing fan either, so the fact that it's destroyed that sport a little bit doesn't bother me either. <laughs> I respect boxing. Uh, I respect WWE wrestling far more. <laughs> oh, yeah. You like the, the soap opera end of it. Is it the stories that get you? It's the novelty and just the fact that you just got these massive people with superhuman um, stamina yeah. <laughs> able to pull yeah. off stuff whilst looking ridiculous and talking ridiculously. Yeah. And, and you feel like you, you yeah, enjoy it in a different way than you did when you were younger, maybe. Oh, yeah. Because you know it's fake, but like there's now this theatrics to it that give it a different kind of value. WWE is the best thing to watch with other people of our age on Discord as like a, a laugh session. It yeah, really yeah. is enjoyable for that alone. Not for like, got to keep up with the current stories. It's like yeah. watching the classics oh. from when we were younger. So good. Alex Smith. Oh, I won. Right. Did you win the Get entire in. thing? Oh, I think yeah, you did. Did. So, Congratulations. Did. But who's yeah. really winning? And that is Logan Paul. So thank you for watching, everybody. Uh, I hope you. you tune in for more of our random talking over GTA playlists. If you want us to do more of this, of yes. course, uh, leave a like and sub. And we'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.